Hey, what's up, everybody? It's Joshua here at Smirk Studios, and today I'm just going to teach you how you can make money on Fiverr. So go ahead and go to uh, Fiverr.com. Let's do it like this. Huh? Let's go. This is what you should see on Fiverr.com. You're going to join. I've already joined, uh, but if you want, you can sign in with Facebook or Google. That makes it really easy getting started. A lot of the work will be done for you. Then you don't have to go check out a how-to video on how to sign up for a website. Uh, I'm certainly not going to judge you. All right, take a look now at what we've got here. This is my uh, my setup because I'm already signed uh, signed in. I followed all the um, I followed all the insight uh, tutorials and everything that they kind of make you go through. Uh, oh, by the way, you should know that you, you do need to start on the website on their computer. It, the app is great, um, but it's kind of more designed as a remote for services after you've worked it all out on the computer. Most of this stuff takes confirming and it's a lot of back and forth. So if you don't have a computer, definitely go to the library or something, spend the day, spend the time, because if you're trying to make money quick, this is the fastest way. All right. Uh, so get your computer going. Do what the website suggests. Everything it says that doesn't cost you money. If it's like trying to make you pay for a service, obviously don't do that. Uh, we're here to try to make some money. Those services that you can pay for are also great. Uh, but, you know, let's make some money today, huh? All right, moving on. Uh, let's take a look at what I've got here. Let's take a look at my profile. In fact, I've got it all set up here. Where is it? Uh, oops, uh, wrong one. There we go. Okay, and here it is. We've got, I've got, you can make up to seven gigs. Once you've gotten, you're going to jump through all the hoops and you're all set up. Uh, it's going to want you to create gigs, right? So create a gig. Remember that this is going to take you probably all day or all night, depending on what time of day you're trying to do this, uh, to set up because you really want to spend the time. So set up your profile. Make sure it looks good. Like, honestly, look at mine. Like, this is decent. You know, this is a decent profile. Uh, and, my, you know, it's rated four out of five stars. That's, you know, how's yours looking? Uh, let's make yours look more like mine. If you want those higher ratings, I'll tell you how to get them. I've only made one sale so far. And so I learned quite a lot from that. And I'll teach you how you can uh, get higher ratings. And I, I actually know. Uh, and I'm going to show you how to do it. I'll do another video, too, to show you how I improved my own rating. Let's see. All right, so here's my gig. What you want to do on any of your gigs, whatever your service is, whether you're doing voice acting or anything, um, uh, you know, there's a myriad of different things you can do on this website. Um, but whatever your service is or whatever you're doing, I don't even really, honestly, I don't care if you're who you're scamming or what you're doing. I'm drawing pictures for people. Here's an example of it. I've got a picture of it. It's very important to have a picture. I usually have a couple pictures. Now, this is the... Uh, one I made for my customer, uh, my client. Uh, here's the username it tells you. So that was uh, that was honestly a fun project. It was a lot of fun. He came to me because he likes, uh, uh, you know, band stuff. And so anyway, picture it says like all this detailed information here. He had like a QR code uh, on there and stuff. Uh, we'll talk more about that project in just a second. But uh, put on the face of your project kind of something that really pops that says what you're about and what you do. So on this gig, I will design your poster or flyer perfect for bands or business. And I'm hoping to attract that. Honestly, this is a little wordy, and I am considering dropping that. So you do want to think about stuff like that. Because all of this, if I'm trying to say stuff like this, I can say that down here. And uh, it's going to come up in the search because the words are available for the spiders to touch and everything. I don't want to tell you how the internet works or anything, but I definitely want to tell you how Fiverr works. So this is wordy. I will probably edit this. Let's even, uh, is it possible? Yeah, let's, take, let's edit my gig. Shoot, here we are. Let's do it. All right, we're going to go. Uh, this is all set up. Once you're getting through it now, if you're first making the gig, you have to go in order. But I'm able to click around since I've already done this. Uh, what am I going to fix? Oh, that's right. We're going to go to the overview. Uh, design your poster or flyer. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take out that comma, and I'm going to take all that, copy it, remove it, 
We want to save it before we move on. And then we're going to go to the description. And uh, all right, and we're going to go ahead and just paste it right here. And that way, I'm still getting the um, SEO optimization and everything. That's kind of what it becomes about. Google it. It's going to save your Fiverr and your business. All right, save. We're all set up. We're going to scroll up, and we're going to now take a look at our uh, at our setup. Let's, uh, I'm all set up here. How do I get out of this thing? I'm trying to teach you how to do it, and I'm not sure. We'll just go back to my Fiverr. All right, it should be all set. Should uh, yeah, look at that. That looks better. It's gonna even do better, even though it's already my best seller. But again, one sale. Yeah, uh, I've got a lot of uh, interest in all these other things. It will. It tells you uh, um, there's st statistics and everything like that if you're trying to find out. But that's all information that you uh, probably could do without. So my average selling price. Look at that. One sale, and I made $115. I was with a tip and everything. How you can do it is by uh, doing exactly what the website suggests you should do and then um, being super nice to your people. Here's, here's what it is, communication. I've got a lot of interest in Fiverr right now. There's a lot of people uh, who want some stuff and we're all dialing in different projects and stuff. So uh, you can expect the next video, uh, video will have a lot more experience behind it. But for now, let's take a look at uh, this so um, my client I'm not going to open the message and uh, reveal all the, the trouble and stuff but there was actually a little bit of difficulty in communication that's why it's so important that your gig is clear so I felt mine was clear but uh, some of these people don't understand what you're going through as a um, as a uh, freelancer so if that's the case um, and you can sense that at all definitely try to beat it to the punch because it, it's going to help you down the line um, be aware of the time frames that it takes to do your project because maybe uh, maybe I should have had more time for the project in the eyes of the, the client you know um, in my opinion I should have given the client less time so the longer um, the shorter your obviously the more time you give yourself on your gig um, the more time you're gonna have to work on it but that's also the longer you're gonna have until you get paid so keep that in mind too, but don't uh, don't press it, man. Uh, you well, you want those good ratings. Um, so I've got a lot. Like I said, a lot of people are interested in things I'm doing because I'm uh, typing everything out right uh, and everything. You're gonna get views if you're if you're if you come and look. So so and clicks too. Like people are actually clicking and they're interested. Uh, let's take a look at the earnings now. So now let's say you've sold your gig. And it's like, well, Josh, I just want the money. That's the part I'm having the trouble with. And I'm going to tell you, don't call me Josh. I never gave you that permission. It's Joshua, plain and simple. Uh, you'll do well to say it. I'm just kidding. Uh, but check it out. You can just go to your earnings tab. You see how I've withdrawn $88? Well, what happened to that 115 to 18 the difference? Oh, geez, you know, I'm being ripped off. No, no. Uh, standard manager pay would be like 15 or 20 percent. Fivers is 20 percent. Obviously, they're going to take the highest they can. Um, you know, you can do this same stuff outside of Fiverr, but you don't have a website, do you? That's why you're here. So uh, come on and take a look. You just set up. You go to your earnings tab. Set up your purchase, uh, your uh, your direct deposit. I'm sorry, and your your PayPal if you want to go that route. Uh, you're going to probably yeah, whichever is easiest for you. I'm not going to tell you or suggest what uh, you might be dealing with out there in, in internet land. But you can certainly set up your direct deposit, go straight to your bank. There's a minimum of $10 withdrawal amount, which is totally fine. And you can only do it once a day. Now, here's the thing. If you're like, well, okay, I've done all that stuff. I'm having trouble because it's telling me I, I have pending clearance. Maybe you haven't seen it in pending clearance. It's going to be there for a couple weeks. Uh, rest assured... There should be a date down here that tells you something like, uh, let's see here. Uh, yeah, funds cleared. It, it says order. Yeah, it used to say pending, right? And that's terrifying. I'm like, what? Are they going to cancel it? No, they're not. You made the money. You just got to wait. It's all part of the process. Now, I believe, and I will make a video to confirm, but I believe it is as easy, and based on what I've read, it's as easy as withdrawing daily. 
Uh, you can withdraw once a day. So uh, if you're making, you know, minimal uh, uh, money on it, like five dollars a pop, don't feel bad. Uh, you can m make five stack up quick. Uh, and also, word to the wise: if it's five to twenty dollars, they don't uh, they don't charge you that twenty percent. So you're thinking, oh man, wait, they charge twenty percent, and I. Uh, I'm only I'm, what I'm supposed to sell it for five dollars. So I'm going to make uh, what uh, is it four dollars? No, no. You get your full five dollars. It's uh, it's catering to people who are willing to sell for twenty or less. But uh, I'm selling for hundreds, and so I'm taking uh, you know, taking a little bit of a cut. Uh, but that's okay because I'm making hundreds. So, all right. Uh, hopefully that answers all your questions. Uh. Please subscribe. Uh, ask me some questions. I got all kinds of uh, answers for you, probably. This is just one of many videos I would like to do for you. If you have uh, something you're like, Josh, how do I do this? I'm pretty keen on the internet, and I'm pretty able uh, in terms of figuring stuff out. So uh, just post what you'd like to know more about in the comments. Go ahead and subscribe, like, and share with your friends. We'll see you next time here at Smirk Studios. Zan.